guys! Today I'm coming to you with my third month update on the Loves Me, Loves Me Not challenge. It is also called the Project 10 Uses Challenge. Uh, this is in collaboration with a handful of people here on YouTube. Uh, Paul is the first one I saw doing this and I asked if I could join in. I've been doing this previously on Instagram and now I'm going to be updating on YouTube as well. So last... Let's see, I still have one, two, three, four, five, five of my original 10 items, and I'm going to be rolling out three items this month. So let's start out with the items that I started with, and then I'll show you each of the updates and where I am with uses on those. The whole point of this is to work these items into your collection and use them 10 times. Decide if they're an item you want to keep, if they're an item you want to declutter. Some of these items I figured out are things that I want to project pan, so that has been super helpful. So the first item that I have is the Tarte Blush in Sweet. It is just a mini size and I have officially used this 10 times so I will be rolling this out. I do really enjoy this blush. I will be keeping it and I like it. The next item is the Bare Minerals Blush in Grand Entrance and this is what it looks like. It's much more of like a baby pinky blush. I will probably declutter this when um, I get my 10 uses out of it, but I've only used it five times so far. Then I have my Clinique Acne Solutions Foundation. I've only used this twice. I have a couple of other foundations and project pans, so this is just something that I totally forgot to use this last month. I have the Hey Honey Trick or Treat concealer. So this I've used nine times. If I had worn makeup yesterday, I would have been able to roll this out today. But since I didn't, I'm going to count this as completed. I'm going to use it tomorrow. And so that's why I'm rolling out three items. I know this only has nine uses, but it will have 10 uses tomorrow. So instead of sitting on only nine products for the entire month, I'm going to go ahead and roll this out now and just use it one more time and then be done with it. I also have my Ulta Matte Eye Primer. Ignore my broken nail. I'm going to go see my lady in a couple days. Um, this I've used 10 times, so I will be rolling it out. I really liked this. I may potentially pan this, but I'm definitely going to use this project as a way to go through all of my eye primers and figure out if I want to keep them or not. So I won't be panning this soon, but I could end up panning this. So those are all the items that are left from my original update, like from my start. So now I only have one, two. So I only have three of the original items left in the project. And then the first update I rolled in the Urban Decay Naked Lipstick. I've used this three times. I don't like this formula compared to the old formula. I've completely used up the old formula version, but I don't like this one as much. And I may end up decluttering this once I use this, use this 10 times in the project. I also had put in the L'Oreal Rouge Ink lipstick, liquid lipstick in I Create. I received this in a influencer box. I love the wand. I think it's great. It's definitely a my lips but better shade and um, this was already something that I was enjoying so I thought that this was a great item to put in and I've used it seven times already. And then my second month update, so in March, I rolled three more items in. I rolled in my NARS Rakugian pencil. It definitely needs to be sharpened, but I'm right there at the S. I've used this five times. I don't really enjoy this. I filmed some videos last week with this on and then a gloss over the top. I will probably project panned this, but it's not something that I would repurchase. I also put in the Clinique um, quick liner for eyes intense. I received this in a Sephora play and I have so many liners that I wanted to make sure that this was something that I was actually going to use. So I put it in this project 
it is a smaller one. It is one of those ones that when you click it up, you can't click it back down. I've used this four times. I do really like it. Um, I will probably keep this one when it comes time to roll this out of the project, but I am enjoying it. I am not enjoying it as much as this product though. This is the Tarte Rainforest of the Sea Volume 3 and I am loving this. I wasn't quite sure what to do with this and then I started using it like that's what I have on my inner corner right now. I freaking love it. Um, I've used this seven times. I will absolutely be keeping this and now I think that once I finish this one out I might roll in one of the because I have all three I might roll in one of the other two and get some use out of those because I, d I don't like this with a brush I only like using it with my fingers and so now that I figured out that I like using it with my fingers I'm very excited to play with it some more so I'm rolling out the sweet blush from Tarte and the eye primer from Ulta and then I will be rolling out the Hey Honey concealer tomorrow. So I have three items I'm rolling in. The first item I'm rolling in is the Ofra Rodeo Drive highlighter. This is a beautiful highlighter and I really don't think I've used it enough so I'm excited to get some use out of that. I also have rolled in the Laura Mercier Little Travel Size Rose Gold Eye Base. This is all I have left. So I definitely think that once I get through the 10 uses on this, this will probably end up in a project pan. But I want to use this project to get through eye bases and eye primers. So in addition to that, I'm also putting in my Lorac Behind the Scenes Eye Primer. I, like I said, I want to work through my eye primers. I believe I have like 10 or 11, maybe even more. And I don't know which ones I like, which ones I don't like. I keep bringing new ones in and I'm not using them up. So I need to pass down the ones to my sister or some friends that don't have a problem with me passing on sanitized makeup and only keep the ones that I actually like and enjoy and just have a collection that I enjoy using instead of having stuff sitting in the drawers because I think it looks pretty and not actually get good use out of the projects that I spent money on. So that is my update. This, I believe this is a year long project and so far I've hit goal on eight items in this project in the last three months. So I'm very excited for that. I'm enjoying picking items that I also have that type of item in a project pan so that I can venture off of those and try out other things that are in my collection. If you're doing this project or on YouTube or on Instagram, leave your information down below. I'd love to check you out and I'll see you guys in another video. Bye!